Welcome back. This is uh, our third episode here, the video, video video interviews. We are joined this time by uh, Caroline Barr, first year student from Pine City, New York, who plays volleyball and basketball, and Sydney Bateman, who's also a first year student uh, from Edmiston, New York, who plays basketball and softball. Uh, guys, thanks for joining. Yeah. How are we feeling today? Oh, we're good. We're good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Great. Good to hear. Um, so let's go back so you guys obviously didn't go to high school together but um you might have similar recruitment stories so how did you end up here who recruited you how did you first hear about us so i actually got recruited for volleyball by mark and i was just looking to go somewhere and found wells i met mark and it i knew that i wanted to go here coach lucas nice yep sydney um i actually had always wanted to go to home lane but with money that wasn't a great choice so I wasn't sure where I actually wanted to go and then a family friend mentioned that they visited here and they thought I would like it so I came for a visit and I talked with coach rock about basketball and then here I am here we are <laughs> was for either of you was it like important that you played both sports or one sport or like what were you thinking as far as that um, I actually wasn't expecting to play sports in college so like this was just kind of well. bonus <laughs> <laughs> so I actually haven't played basketball since 10th grade and I was not expecting to play basketball I did want to play volleyball in college though for as long as I've played but not okay. basketball. so you played <laughs> but you played volleyball all throughout high school yeah okay. yep okay um Sydney I know you just said Lemoyne was probably the number one choice mm -hmm. um did you what about you Caroline did you like was Wells at the top how, how did Wells kind of Put or get pushed to the top? See, I kind of like, it was a little rushed, you know. I, <laughs> I came and visited and I kind of just knew right away. I really didn't even look at many other schools. Like, I, I liked the team, I liked the atmosphere. So, kind of yeah. just knew. It <laughs> said that you, did you come for like an official visit at all or? Um, I came. Not really. I don't think it was. Not really. <laughs> <laughs> I just scheduled the visit, and then, yeah, it just kind of happened. Took like a tour, right? Yeah, just okay. a normal tour. And with a student or with coach? With a student, and okay. then just got to meet coach too. So the student was a exceptional tour guide. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> and now you're both here, dual sport athletes. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, playing both these sports, um, growing up, either way. Um, whatever you were playing, uh, coaches can have like a certain impact on you. Growing up, who do you think, which coach, I guess, in either sport and at any grade had like the biggest impact on you? And do you still maybe communicate with or still think about what they taught you? Um, mine would be my modified basketball coach who also was my coach my senior year of varsity basketball. Um, she was also a teacher at my school, so I was super close with her. And I still talk to her, like, whenever I'm having trouble, I call her, talks me through it, so. Did you have her as a teacher, too, or just a coach? Uh, yeah, I did. What does she teach? Uh, she's a special education teacher, mm -hmm. so just for, like, extra help. Nice. Yeah, for me, mine would probably be my volleyball coach for varsity, but I did play, like, club with him, and he was also a teacher at my school, so we also became close. And he just impacted me a lot with volleyball. What was the what's the club team? Um, Elmira Storm. Storm. Yep. Okay. Yep. <laughs> All right. How how long did you play for the club team? Um, since eighth grade until my senior year. Okay. Yep. Awesome. Is there? Do you still like keep in contact with any of the girls from the club team or women women from the club team? Yeah, I do. Actually, a lot of like my closest friends from home mm -hmm. were on the team, so. We're all pretty close still, for sure. Nice. Um, another, obviously, thing that you guys have in common is the balancing of the dual sports with uh, the educational side. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it can be successful sometimes, maybe less successful other times. Um, can each of you kind of talk a little bit about how you kind of handle that? Maybe some positive outcomes, or not positive outcomes, but ways that you find kind of help you be successful on that side? And, Maybe someone who's helped you be successful. 
Yeah, I feel like playing sports actually makes me do better in school. Like, I feel when I'm in season, I just push myself harder in school just to be able to play the sport and be successful <laughs> in it. So that definitely helps. Um, it is difficult to <laughs> balance both, but you get there and you have people that help you on the way, so it makes it easier mm -hmm. for sure. <laughs> um, so when I first got here, I – wasn't doing my work, <laughs> Come on. Um, but I knew I wanted to play basketball, so I kind of had to get my grades up, um, and I ended up talking with Coach Rock, so I started meeting with her and doing work in her office, um, which has helped a lot, and I still do that, probably will do that for the rest of the time I'm here, <laughs> uh, she keeps me on top of it, so... Okay, so let's dig into this, Sydney. Why were we not doing the work? <laughs> <laughs> I, just, I, don't know. I didn't have the motivation to do it. Right, but then you had to be eligible to play. Yeah. So, was it? Were you going to class? I was going to class. Okay. <laughs> just not doing the work. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, so, if you guys aren't playing sports here, or going to class, what's going on on campus? Like, what do you like to do? Um, we hang out with each other. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Um, take naps. <laughs> Are you guys aware of tea time on Wednesdays? Yes, I've been once. I have not been. <laughs> no, I have not, been. but sounds fun. Not involved just in the student activities? <laughs> just haven't made it there yet, you know. Been busy. Now that you're out of season, maybe we'll make it? Yeah, for sure. I'll definitely try to make it now. Okay. Yeah. And then I know there's something going on tonight for the men's game. Will you guys be at Salmer to watch the men's game, or are we going to watch this privately? Um, I have practice other, maybe? until 6, so I'll be a little late. If I watch it, we are gonna watch it privately. <laughs> <laughs> we might stop in, but you know we get a little loud for our teams here. Mm -hmm. Go Wells. We don't. Yeah, we don't need any noise violations. Yeah, exactly, and that's what the worry is. So you know. Interesting. Yeah. Okay. Um, so uh, we're getting close to the end of the year. Not as close, I'm sure, as you guys would like. Um, <laughs> summer's coming up. What do we have planned for the summer? What do your summers usually look like? Take me through it here. Um, I'm going to be working, I'm not quite sure where yet, but I'm going to get a job and then spend time with like my friends and family back home before I come back. Yeah, I'm going to be working, spending time with family. I spend a lot of time at the lake in the summer, so. Oh, what lake is this? Seneca. Okay. Yep. So. Are we on the lake, like water skiing or like? I tube. I okay, tube. tubing. Skiing, I don't know if that would be my thing, but for sure. Too. Okay, and, yep. and uh, you already have a job? I do have a job. Okay. I work with kids. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, okay, so you I work with kids. <laughs> um, I guess that is kind of like another thing we can dig into. Like, what's your major? Business. Okay, so you don't want to work with kids. I don't want to work with kids. Um, see, it's in the summer, so we really just play games all day mm -hmm. and – it's just somewhere where they go when their parents are working. It's like from yeah. age five to twelve, maybe something like that. So yeah, just a little day camp that they yeah. can get yeah. some sun, run around, a little activity. Yeah. Sydney, what uh, what are you studying? Um, my major is education. Okay, so you might be more interested in working with kids. Yes. Are you looking? Do you know if you are looking like younger kids or like high school kids? Younger kids. Sure. <laughs> Can't do <high> <laughs> <laughs> okay, I don't blame you there. Um, okay, so you guys are doing great. I don't. <laughs> yeah, for sure. <laughs> there, so, some more of the fun questions uh, that we uh, haven't gotten into yet. You probably, or I know you have the same answer for this, but maybe favorite movie or TV show that you guys are thinking of. Um, my movie would be Breakthrough, okay. and then my TV show is Grey's Anatomy. I'm not sure I have a favorite TV show. Or <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> <Movie>. <laughs> I'm not sure I have a favorite movie, but mm -hmm. my favorite TV show would definitely be Grey's Anatomy. Okay. What do you, what do you mean you don't have a favorite movie? I don't like, know. I like a lot of movies. Do you not watch movie. movies? Okay. Which one do you like? Um, I love Soul Surfer. Like, that yeah. is a good That's movie. A good Soul Surfer. Yes. Isn't that from, like, 2000? Yeah, it's an older movie, but it's with like it's great. Yeah, that's a great movie. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I like movies based on true stories. Yeah, me too. Like Soul Surfer is a true story. Oh wait, yes. is that the one arm surfer? Yes. Oh, yes. Very inspirational. Yes, that's for true. sure. I forgot about that. Um, 
What are we? So, let me let me set the scene here. So, you guys just came off a huge game, whether it's volleyball, basketball, whatever, and you're starving. What do you really want? Mac and cheese, one hundred percent mac and cheese, <laughs> always number well, one choice. Okay. <laughs> um, mine would be pasta, but while I'm at college, it's ramen. So, <laughs> <No>. <laughs> yes, ramen. <laughs> so, what kind of ramen? Um, chicken. Chicken, like the little flavor packet. Yeah. What about like the cup of noodles that has like the vegetables no. in it? What? I'm not a big fan of those. Why? I'm like. It's better. Fan, but, like, I'm, I just. It's a, it's mobile. You could eat it on the go. Yeah, I know. I just. Yeah, that is true. That is true. Well, we just never it? get them. Yeah. We always just get the normal. Just normal. Oh. Ramen. Um, what's the favorite mac and cheese? Like Panera? Kraft, Panera. Kraft. Kraft. Any, any <laughs> mac and cheese wins. Any mac and cheese wins. It doesn't even matter what. If it's noodles and cheese, it's good. <laughs> That's mind-boggling. <laughs> um, okay, so what about favorite holidays? Favorite times of year, favorite holiday. What are we thinking? Um, mine would be St. Patrick's Day because it's my birthday. Okay. Mm-hmm. Not in. What about the St. Patrick's Day food? Not like sauerkraut? Is that a thing? No. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> can't do that. I don't like the food. Okay. Not at all. <laughs> mine would probably be Thanksgiving for the traditions, not the food. Food isn't even like. My do you have part. wait? Do you have mac and cheese on Thanksgiving? I don't. Isn't that what? crazy? Mm-hmm. I know. Everybody calls me I crazy, but I don't. I mean, yeah, yeah me neither, Actually, but you I just said it's your favorite food. Oh, do. Oh, yeah, see, I don't. But, but as your favorite food, I think you should, you know, I think try I should get start, that involved. Even if it's craft. Like, it doesn't even have to well, be Well, I would thing. encourage you not to go with the craft. But yeah. <laughs> um, but, yeah, you should definitely get mac and cheese involved somehow. Yeah, it's a good side dish with the turkey. <laughs> um, okay, so... You can have multiple answers to this, but a, a pregame song that kind of like gets you pumped up, gets you going. What do we think? I think mine for volleyball this year would be "Knife Talk" by Drake. Was, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I think that would be it. Um, for basketball, I would say "Push and Pee." Mm-hmm. Gonna. I that a lot. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what about like? Do you, is there going to be a new one this year for softball, or are we just going to keep rolling with "Push and Pee"? I don't know. It just like happens, like the first game, you listen to a song, and then you just got to keep listening to it. Yeah, I That's good luck. Are you guys superstitious? I am. <laughs> what? I am. <laughs> well, what are the superstitions? Like, it, do you have to wear like the same socks? Yes, or do you yes like same socks. It? Yeah, for sure. <laughs> like the same everything. Same everything, yeah. yeah like, it's just... <laughs> same, same socks, same meal, same like schedule? Yeah, my, my schedule just, stays the same. Yeah. yeah. Which is definitely hard, like when you have games like on weekends and then games on weekdays because it can't be the same. Yeah, so, you like, gotta have like a weekend. Yeah. Superstition, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So, are there any other? Uh, I don't know. Last minute questions? You guys want to maybe ask each other? Ask me. Oh, I have another one. Mm-hmm. Um, so the, we have one on campus dining hall. What's like the best thing you've had there? <laughs> Bagel sandwiches. Bagel sandwiches. sandwiches. I heard there were <laughs> bagel did. sandwiches. Okay, yes. what's on these sandwiches? So we put, so you toast the bagel. I'm just going to walk you through the whole thing. Okay. Okay? You so do the toasting the or they do the toasting? We no, do the we toasting. Do okay. You put it through the toaster. <laughs> How toasted do we want it? Burnt or we like? We put it on like four, three yeah. and a half, four on the yeah. thing. Out I don't know what? what that means. but Like it's what's the highest awesome. it goes to? I don't know. Probably eight, I think. It's eight. Okay, we put okay it like so we're going halfway. Got it. Yeah, and then we take some provolone cheese, put it on both sides of the bagel, and then two pieces of turkey and put it in the inside. And then we put it in the panini press, and we smush it. You guys have access to all of this, like... Yeah. Yeah. This is our creation. This is our creation. And turkey. we eat it almost every day. Yeah. How, why'd, we, why'd we pick turkey? Is it, what, are the, what are your choices? You can't put, like, egg in it or something? Uh, we could, and we just don't. Yeah. Hmm. We just, that's it. I heard there was a pancake bar yesterday. Do you guys do the pancake bar? I was not there. Yeah, for the pancake not bar. What? <laughs> Coach G, shout out Coach G, was taking a recruit over there and they had a pancake bar. Oh, that's what? crazy. I did not even know that was a thing. Wow. Yeah. So you guys, what about, okay, there's an, another place to eat on campus that's uh, open sometimes called The Well. What is their favorite <laughs> thing to eat at The Well? Mine is the Chipotle pizza or chicken tenders. Wait, Chipotle, what's on a Chipotle pizza? Or is it just like a cheese pizza with Chipotle sauce? No, there's no. chicken, yeah. bacon, um, barbecue sauce, 
and Chipotle mayo. And Is then, it the Chipotle mayo on the yeah. top? Yeah, they like drizzle it on the top. And then okay. there's peppers and onions on them, but I don't get them. Yeah, we don't get them. Yeah, hold the veggies, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Caroline? Um, my thing that I get there is a cheese quesadilla. Huh. Yeah. <laughs> or the Chipotle pizza. The Chipotle pizza is really good. What about, like, a cheese quesadilla, but, like, Chipotle sauce on the side? You could dip it in. I do that. Yeah, I do mm-hmm. do that. And it is good. The Chipotle mayo, definitely the best sauce you can get there, I would okay. say. Interesting. Uh, Moe's or Chipotle? Mm-hmm. <laughs> See, that's such a hard question because I get too. I think it's pretty things. easy. Um, I was gonna say Moe's, but I know that a lot of people disagree with that. Why so. Moe's? Are you a queso fan or something? No, I get a just a bowl at both places. I just I'm more of just like a tomato person, and they don't just have tomatoes; they have salsa and chipotle. And I can't do the salsa and chipotle, and I don't get much on my stuff. So what's the bowl? Rice, chicken. Rice, chicken. Cheese, sour cream, tomatoes. <laughs> 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 so, so, like, without the tomatoes, it's mm. kind of just like... Yeah, you lose, yeah. L- lose a little bit of flavor there. Yeah. And some, and some color, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you, you have secretly not answered over here. Yeah, I don't know. That's a hard question because I get two completely different things. Okay, well, well what do you get then? I get a quesadilla at most, but I get a bowl at Chipotle. What about a stack what is at most? Like the okay. crunch wrap thing? Do you guys <laughs> okay? Do you guys like Taco Bell? Yes. Okay, Crunchwrap Supreme. Oh, that's what it's like. Yeah. Okay. Except you make your own. You can put whatever you want in it. Oh. That's it, most. Okay. Maybe but I but I do Bell. think Chipotle is better. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I get that. I get that. The only thing better at most is the queso because the Chipotle queso is kind of. Um, I like that you don't have to pay for your chips at Mo's either. Yeah. Mm, that's true. You can ask oh. for like extra chips, and they're yeah. like, "Oh, we'll give them to you for free." Okay. Welcome to Moe's, that little slogan, that's nice. I don't always get a welcome to Moe's <laughs> when I go there. Oh, really? Yeah. See, I do. Maybe I it's just like. the place I go to, but yeah. Yeah. Sometimes they're falling asleep. <laughs> um, so do we drink tea or coffee? Like, if we need to stay up, what are we drinking? A Monster? A Red Bull? Oh, I'm drinking a coffee. Always. I'm always drinking Cream coffee. Cream and sugar? Yes, for sure. How I just stay up. <laughs> I just stay up. I don't know. I don't like coffee, and I'm not a big tea person, so. Like, I'll drink tea, but like. Not a big tea person. So you're just really hoping you catch that second wind. Yeah. And <laughs> power through it. Cream, are we going cream and sugar, hot and hot or cold? Cold, iced all the way. Co- Never hot. Never Why? Hot. I don't know. It's just not. I like iced coffee with cream and sugar. Usually just From vanilla. From where? Duncan. Not as big of a fan as Starbucks. Why? Starbucks is better. <laughs> See, I disagree. I think Duncan coffee is better. Well, it, does it really taste that much different if you, like, load it up with cream and sugar? No. Yeah, exactly. I wouldn't say so, but Duncan. Okay. For the win, I think. Do you guys ever, like, order food from off-campus around here? Order or not order, food? but, like, go get food um, off-campus? McDonald's. Or McDonald's. 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 Mm-hmm, yeah. All right, what are we getting? Chicken nuggets. McChicken. <laughs> what? You get the McChicken now when they have, like, the actual chicken sandwich? I still get the McChicken. <laughs> yeah, no, I no, still That's get like the a chicken, chicken patty. <laughs> <laughs> but it's good, so it's okay. Do you stack it, like, in between a double cheeseburger or something? No. What? Just the, okay. Just the McChicken. That's it. Fries? That's it. No nuggets? Fries. I get nuggets sometimes, but mostly a McChicken. Do we dip the fries? Mmm. No. Sometimes. It sometimes depends. not really, though. I like the honey mustard dip. Mm. Put the fries in it. What about the nuggets? Are they just... Um, it depends. Sometimes barbecue sauce, sometimes nothing. Wow. You guys are really mood-based eaters over here. <laughs> buffalo sauce, though. Yeah, the buffalo sauce yeah. is good. Mm-hmm. If you, if <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> That's a no from Sydney on the buffalo sauce. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, McDonald's. That's, is that the only thing around here? Taco, Taco Bell. Bell. We get Taco Bell a lot. Um, we've that was not a very times. positive review of Taco Bell. <laughs> <laughs> no, Taco Bell is a good option. We just don't go as much as McDonald's. Do you get a cheese quesadilla? I do. I actually don't, I don't think. <laughs> not, no. <laughs> what, what do we get? What am I getting? No I free get ads here, but yeah, I guess we'll talk <laughs> about Taco Bell. The potato taco. The <laughs> <laughs> you're, I mean, you're not a vegetarian, are you? Uh, not, not that, it, like, that's, I'm just saying, like, no, based I'm on your other answers, you're not. <laughs> that is crazy, but no, it's mm. just 
instead of meat, it is potatoes, and it is good. Hmm. What about the, did you ever get the Fiesta potatoes that they used to have? That were like potatoes with cheese and sour cream and stuff? Mm -hmm. Wow, before your time. Okay. <laughs> uh, Sid, are you, you get the quesadilla. Yeah. Any sides? No. What? <laughs> 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 You guys have really not explored the menus of these places very, very widely, have we? Mm -hmm. What about, mm, what else is around here? What about pizza? Is there a place to get pizza around here? Or is pizza not really a thing? Besides the well, yeah, obviously. Yeah, I feel like we've gotten pizza a lot, like, on trips, mm. like, when we're traveling for sports, but I don't... Where, where was your favorite road trip this year? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> it, can be any, it can be any sport. It can be um, any sport. I would say when we went to, I don't know. Where was the hotel where was, we had the balcony? The balconies. Where was that? That was um, <laughs> in D.C. Yes. Oh, we were okay. In DC. Had a balcony Na in the nation's room. capital. Yep. Yeah. In, yeah, she, her room had a balcony on it. Wow, like, nice. Titan really? like nice. Titanic. Nice. Yeah. yeah, it was nice. It, was, it wasn't nice weather, though. No, it, it actually was. was. It was? It was nicer, yeah. It was okay. Mm. Okay, and I think. What about the food on that trip? That was okay? I don't even remember. remember what we ate. I feel like I always get chicken tenders if we don't <laughs> pizza, so. everywhere we go. Yeah. <laughs> That's usually what it is. Hmm. Okay, well, no more qu any questions from you guys to each other? Something you really want to know? I really want to get on tape? All right, well, thank you for joining us. You guys have been uh, quite the exciting pair over here. <laughs> And I'm sure we'll get the most views ever so far with the two of you. But uh, thank you. And I hope the rest of your seasons go well. The rest of your school years go well. And uh, thanks for joining. Thanks for having us. Of course. <laughs>